<laughs> In a time of enormous crisis, I might have known the government have you boys doing the work of a common clerk. Well, thank you for your input, citizen. I'm glad you find life so funny. <laughs> My pleasure. Do you think this poor girl's family finds life quite so funny right now? Family? I assume she was a common killer. She's a missing person. Missing presumed dead, I guess. But you keep cracking them jokes. I'm sorry, mister. I guess I spoke a little out of turn. I ain't the one you should be apologizing to. Just find the girl. She's 15. Millicent Waterbury. Come on now. Eat. Sometimes I think I've been drugged. Pardon me. Ah! <sighs> Come on. It's either me or someone in you. Let's go! Are you Millicent? Yes. Come on. Your family's worried sick. God help us. Thank God 
glad you came along. What were you doing out here by yourself? We were so hungry. Even if the forts are enough to go around, I just wanted to find something to eat. There ain't no food out here but us right now, miss. You should stay where it's safe. I've heard that somewhere before. You from around here? Climb on. Let's get you home. Yeah. Did you see them clawing at the house like a pack of wolves? It was like they could smell me in there. No offense, miss, but they could. It's horrific. Are they alive or dead? Somewhere in between, I reckon. It's some kind of punishment for our sins, isn't it? It's a curse. My pa warned me, but I didn't listen. This is all my fault. What are you talking about? I, I kissed a man and we weren't even betrothed. <laughs> Don't worry. Believe me, if that's the extent of your sins, I'm in a whole heap more trouble than you are. Let's go! It just gets worse! Easy. You're telling me. I mean, my Uncle Pete gets incoherent and mighty gropy from time to time and coughs up some bilious horrors of a morning, but never anything like this. I'm pretty sure whatever your Uncle Pete's got is saloon related. Now let's try to get you back to whatever is left of your family in one piece. Yeah! Here we are. I can't seem to get away from this place. <laughs> like I said, thank you. Good luck helping your family, Mr. Marston. Thank you. Plenty of more just like him, Mr. Comedian. We got a whole host of missing folk. <laughs> <laughs>